Hola. Hello, everyone. We're out in the park. Quiet down back there. There's so many kids playing <laughs> behind us. Yeah, just ignore the background. Ignore them. <laughs> The Gosh, smell. The birds, the, the birds and the smell of the cherry blossoms in March. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome to our channel. We are Sisters in Stitches. I'm Cindy. That's my sister, Debbie. And we are doing some stitches tonight. It is my stitch fix. How many times can I say stitches? And this is Cindy's 71st stitch fix. Mm -hmm. 71 she's had. There are some possibilities <coughs> in this one, and I'm getting a little nervous because I opened up a trunk club and there were possibilities in there too. And it's like, ah, oh. will you just let go out? out? Yeah. yeah. She yeah, never barks, she just kind of talks. Go. go out and smell some more. All right, so this one was a little bit better than my last box. My last box was just winter sweaters mixed in, nothing matched, nothing I could put together. So uh, this is one of my favorite colors other than pink when I see it in clothing. And this is a top from Lush. I don't think I've ever heard from Lush. And what a surprise, this is like my tunic top. I don't have enough of those. I have this top, the same exact top, but it's navy blue with white and yellow where the white and gray is. Same maker and everything, so it's probably just another style that they oh, have. Oh, okay. I do. I like the print of this top. I love the colors, but it is so... Well, long. it's a little it's bit heavier. It's a little long. bit heavier knit, so I wouldn't really wear it in the summer. Oh, I would in a minute. No, it's just way too long in the it's back. Too long for you, but that's not a bad summer shirt. No, it's Especially not. Especially in air conditioning. So, offices. and what was the price of this? Um, forty four dollars. It's not a bad bad price point. No, it's not a bad price point. But I'll tell you why I wouldn't keep. The only way I would keep it is if everything else in the box worked, and it was cheaper to keep it. But one, it's a tunic too long in the back, and I also think it was too big on me. I would have to size down. They sent me all two X's and I'm a one X in top. So I'm not sure why it changed. I'll have to go back and look at my profile. Well, this is a two X and fit you good though. Yes, it is true. Most, sometimes I have to size up, but this is from Market and Spruce. And, and it's just, good. it was $28 for this shirt. It's just a black t-shirt, <coughs> but it's definitely not just a cotton. It's probably a rayon blend. I love rayon. Uh, yeah, it's 65% rayon. That's why it hangs so nice. Oh, it's 95% rayon, 5% spandex. So it's a little bit better than just a cotton t-shirt. Mm -hmm. And it's got the little pocket. And what I like most about it, and I don't know how well you can see it in the video, is that the bottom, the back is a little bit longer and it's got the shirt tail kind of hem, so it yeah. doesn't come straight across. It really so, lays nice on you. Yeah, for twenty eight dollars, I don't, I don't know if I don't keep anything in the box, I may keep this because one, it's just kind of a nicer. Yeah, Cindy and I don't quality. pay a styling fee. We have that forty nine dollar annual fee mm -hmm. that we pay, and then we don't pay any styling fees whether we keep stuff or not. So it's kind of nice. No, I do love and old navy. And you get that forty nine dollars back. Yeah. on your next purchase. So it's like it doesn't cost you anything. Yeah, you don't lose it. It's like a no. forever credit. Yeah. So if you only use 20 of it. You can keep it. Yeah. yeah, you can keep it for six months and still be able to pull on it. Yeah. So, so I may consider that. I, I really like Old Navy t-shirts, but they don't usually have rayon in the them. rayon t-shirts. And so I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll think about that one. I'll think about it. Um, they did send me a pair of jeans, which I don't need, and I've even told them I don't need any more jeans. This and is these the are by Silver Jean Company. Yeah, these are by Silver. No, but you know you what? Guys, but I'm getting tired of the distressed look now. It's been I two really years. am. I'm really tired of seeing ripped up jeans on everybody. Now I do wear them occasionally. I do too. I that's I have like ten pairs because they were so popular. But even if they weren't distressed, I wouldn't keep these because I don't like the white right here and nowhere else on the pants. You know, it's dark in the back and then it's lighter on the butt cheeks. I don't need anything to draw attention to my butt cheeks. 
so I don't like the faded white look. If these were just plain dark jeans, by I do like silver jeans. I have a couple pair of them, but I don't like the distressing these retail anymore. Retail for seventy nine dollars, so you better like them. Yeah, which I'm not going to keep them because of the distressing and the white, you know, faded look. And when I saw this in the box, I thought, oh, I like it. This is from Design History, and it's Kiki Sleeveless Open Stitch Shirt. And it's long, and it's a heavier, like, knitted top. So it would be nice in the summer, like in air-conditioned offices with a lot. But it's know, got holes all the way through it, so it's not like it's going to make you hot. And I really wanted to like it, and I told Debbie, it's just too long. She goes, no, Cindy, I think it looks good on you. And I'm like, Really? I think I it do. looks too long. And it's fifty-eight dollars is the retail price for and it. And it's a really good quality. I think it's something she doesn't have. It's something different. I don't. I so don't. So if she was going to keep anything, I told her this would be the thing I would keep. I guess maybe I could, you know, even belt it like you had mentioned. I could wear it with white jeans, or I could wear it. I don't know. I think that it's too long and encompasses my butt. And well, just you got to pull it up it to where it hits your butt in the right with a belt, but. I think a taupe or a cream belt with that, or if you were wearing gray pants, put a gray belt on that, and it's a whole mm -hmm. outfit. So um, I don't know. I think I think that's the prettiest piece in the box. I well, I agree, and I'm kind of on the fence about it. So just because it is different and nothing I have, and then as I lose weight, because I'm actually going to see a nutritional counselor counselor that is being paid by insurance. <laughs> Love it. So I'm going to have all these sessions with her. I'll have to bring the cameras in so you guys can see. Um, but yeah, this is exactly, it's something that I would consider because it's so different from anything that I own in my wardrobe. So that's kind of why we get these boxes, right? To get you out of your comfort zone and to give you things that I, you would never look for in the store. And I got this dress. Debbie says it doesn't look good on me. I think it did. And this is by... Maggie London. I think it's too much in the front. Cindy's got a big chest anyway, and it sticked out. It stuck out even further than it needed to. Oh, I and guess when I she didn't turned look around, the that. back was so much higher than the front really? of the dress. I didn't I thought, think it looked like really. Oh, yeah, wait till you see it, Cindy. Oh, you guys, you guys I chime in. Tell her to... the truth. I know she loves the color and she thinks it looks good on her, but I'm telling you, I've seen better dresses fit her better. I just, I don't have a dress this color. I have one other red dress, but it's kind of like a dressier dress that you would wear to a wedding or something. Yeah, but for almost $80, Cindy, you gotta like it. You really no, gotta I like know, it. I know, but I did. But it's gotta and fit you all nice the too. Thing, yeah, I, I guess. All right, I see, have. I think it's because, see how they have the, all the gathering right here? All this gathered stuff is sticking out away from her chest, and it just, it makes it look like she's going like to a point. Oh, really? Yeah, so look at yourself in the I in the will. Video. I'll look at it because I did not look at it in the video, so I will look at you're it. You're looking down, so you're not seeing what I'm maybe. seeing from the side. Oh, from the maybe. Because I thought, oh my gosh, this would look so cute with a white jean jacket or a blue jean jacket it or would. a red jean jacket or And now you know you want a red dress sweaters. Like this. So just go find a red dress that fits you better. I bet you Old Navy has something I could get. Or tell we Stitch Fix. We need to Fix. go to Old Navy. Tell Stitch Fix. I want all red dresses this time or something so you can find one that you like. We need to just go do an Old Navy haul. All right, whatever. A spring haul, so. Oh, my gosh. All right, tell them how much everything was. So if Cindy were to buy this whole box at retail value, it would be two eighty seven. dollars However... With her twenty, if she were to keep all five pieces, she would get seventy one seventy five off, which would bring it to two fifteen twenty five. The shipping is free. Now that's not tax included, but it's still not a bad price. I so let's just say they put what fifteen dollars worth of tax on. Well, I don't. I, I just do everything off the base price. So it's still not a bad thing, but it wasn't things that wowed me and Cindy's got so many clothes that if it doesn't wow her it's not different she needs to put it back in the box and send it back well I I really would like your opinion on the red dress and on this I as think I know that's the best piece in the box but again this was also what was this $58, $58. so it's cheaper than it really is heavy and that's the that's only part cool that worries me that is a cool piece 
that you can wear all summer long into the fall in the spring i mean it's you a can piece. wear it into winter too you with, could with a turtleneck on. on with a beige turtleneck oh dear people help i like it i like the dress debbie didn't I she like likes the dress. The I don't like the way it fits her. Right. Well, that's what I mean. And she likes that long sweater shirt, and I'm not sure that it fits me right. So, honest to God, I do need your opinions on it. That's all. How does it look on camera? <coughs> all right. Well, this is the first time I really have to wonder about what I'm getting in a Stitch Fix box because they've been like, being sent back almost as quick as they get in. I didn't even film mine. I told Cindy it was such an expensive box this time. It was over $400. And one of the pieces was a, a rust-colored faux suede jacket. I'm like, it's not fall. Yeah. It's spring. I'll put that away now until October. Why That's do you want to buy something now that you're not going to wear for I six know, or exactly. seven months? I was so mad. I just put everything back in the box and sent it back. Well, yeah, Stitch Fix has been hit or miss. I know the transitional period is hard because they, you know, we've already ranted and raved in, the, in our last Stitch Fix about this, so I, I won't go any further. If you want to hear our ranting and raving and how we think that clothing boxes would do better in this weird time of inflation, I'll put the link up there and you can weigh in. So, all right, well, there you have it. Again, opinions, please. And thank you for taking the time. Are there any discount clothing boxes out there that aren't from resale shops? I, I think Nadine West. I used to do that a long time ago, and their clothes are a lot cheaper. But I mean, how changed. cool would it be to have like an old Navy box that you don't have right? to go there for, that, that you could just have sent to your house? I mean, that would be awesome. Well, that's kind of, well, you have to pay for it and then return it. But yeah, not paying for it, trying it on like Amazon Prime where they send you yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. So my Even Amazon. A, a styling fee of some kind. If you keep if you keep a piece, you get that back. That's great. Yeah. I don't mind that. I don't even know what I asked for. I know in my Amazon Prime, I asked for pastel jeans, pastel jean jackets, and button-ups. And in my preview, so I'm anxious to get it, I have a yellow jean jacket mint green jeans that's for another video i know i'm so but video. i don't remember what i asked for so i, I, I any, i'm done asking stitch fix because i never seem to get what i asked for so yeah. i just don't even i don't do you want another yeah sure send, send another one in a couple months i don't care <laughs> <laughs> don't be so excited yeah yeah all right ladies it's getting late we are going to sign off and I think we're done with our filming, too. So Yay, we get to go to bed. To chill. All right. Thanks for tuning in and look forward to your comments. Bye. Bye-bye.